All right, and I don't want to be a negative Nancy or anything, but I do want to go over two more things that I'm not really a huge fan of with the Enphase system. Uh, one is their IQ load controller. This was originally built with the IQ 7 series system um, to, to shed additional PV. And those PV strings were only about 16 amps continuous each. So the thing was kind of built, right? It's just meant to turn PV strings off, uh, right? With that system, we didn't have those grid forming microinverters. So essentially, uh, in an outage, when your home was using less than the PV was making, that IQ load controller would PV shed. It would just flip a switch, turn some of the PV off so that you know you, you weren't at a system at a point where you had more PV than your home or batteries could accept. Um, with IQ8 series, that was a big upgrade, right? They, they essentially, they're grid forming. So as, as your PV is producing, if at any point your home and batteries during a, an outage are using less than your PV is making, the microinverters can curtail themselves instantly to just curtail back to exactly what your home can accept. So there was no really more need for that IQ load controller for PV shedding, but it is kind of pushed as a way to shed large loads in your home. Again, most people with the storage system, when you go in to back up, the utility powers out. You, a lot of people have large heating and air conditioning systems, water heaters, dryers, um, ovens, large loads like that, EV chargers, right? Where when the power goes out, if all that stuff kicks on, it can just cause a system collapse where if your load exceeds the capabilities of your system, the whole thing will just shut down. And those uh, load shedding is a big way to avoid that. Or, or also if you're just really not trying to waste your power, right? Maybe you got a bunch of pool equipment running or a hot tub. When the power goes out, you don't want that system running, wasting your batteries in an outage. You want to turn it off. Load shedding is a great way to do that. Un 